Our top story this morning, the U.K. has now fully vaccinated 60% of its adult population against COVID-19, but the Delta variant remains a massive headache for health authorities. However, it isn't only Britain suffering. Many other countries are also being hit hard by the highly transmissible strain. Eason Zay reports. Having had an early start to its vaccination program and securing a large number of COVID-19 vaccines from the get-go, the UK has been praised for its vast and rapid vaccination rollout. On Thursday, the UK surpassed another milestone, having fully vaccinated 60% of all adults in Britain. More than 31.7 million people have received both doses, while over 82% of the population have had one. Health officials are calling on the public to continue getting their second doses, especially given the situation with the Delta variant. With it now the dominant strain in the UK, the country reported another 16,703 new cases over the past 24 hours, up from 11,007 cases last week. The Delta variant is now being reported in more than 90 percent of new cases in the UK, and health experts warn the daily figure could surpass 20,000. In Germany, the number of COVID-19 infections caused by the Delta variant has doubled over the past week and is likely to gain more traction. In response, Germany's cabinet on Wednesday approved plans to increase borrowing by nearly 120 billion U.S. dollars next year, bringing the total pandemic-linked debt to more than 560 billion dollars. In Israel, the country's COVID-19 czar said Thursday that their indoor mask mandate will return early next week in order to stem a rise in new cases. The announcement comes as the country reported 169 new cases on Thursday, Israel's highest daily tally in months. Despite the latest surge, Israel's health ministry is not yet recommending a restriction on gatherings. Lee Seung-jae, Arirang News.